so now friends we will understand about dimensions of array in numpy so we can have a one dimension array in numpy we can have two dimension array in numpy and like we can have three dimension arrays and even have higher dimensions array in numpy so now let's go to our jupyter notebook and see how we will create this so now we are in our jupyter notebook screen and we will create one dimension array two dimension array and your three dimension array so how we will create it let's see so first of all we will create a variable y equal to np dot array so this is the command which we have to give to create an array uh, in and we will give square brackets sorry round bracket then square bracket and give one to some values here and after this I print y so I just run this is give us an error so I just uh, again I will just import this file run this then I will name is not defined saying then I will run this so it is run so we have first to import numpy and then run this then it's run so we have this one dimension array now if we want to know which type of array is this either it's a one dimension three dimension so we have to write here print we have to give a command print and give y dot n tim and just run this so it is a one dimension it's giving a value one so it means it's a one dimension array now if we have to create a two dimension array so i will write here name ar2 np dot array is the command and i will open the bracket round bracket then i will get the square bracket two times and i will write some number here one two three four and then i will give comma and again i will give the number one two three four so this is our two dimension array so if we want to run this and see first of all we will run this print ar2 and just run this so it is a two dimension array so one thing should be keep in mind like the list which we have created inside the two list need to have an equal number of elements only then your two dimension array will run like if you have four values here and four values here so they both have four values like if you will have three values here and then want to run this program so it will give error so both have equal number of element only then your two dimensional array will work now if you want to see how many it's a, like whether it's a one dimension or two dimension then we have to give this print arn and dim command name of the array and then we have to give and dim and just run this so it will give your two dimension here now if you want to create your three dimension array so i will give you now name here ar3 equal to np dot array is the command and then i will give your round bracket and three times I will give the square bracket and write one two three four comma should be here one two three four and then I will give comma here and then I will copy this and paste this and then comma and paste it so this is our three dimension array and if you want to print it I will just copy this code from here and change the name here here I will take AR3 and here also I take AR3 dot endim so endim is the command to know how what type of array is this either is a one dimension two dimension or three dimension and if we want to create your multi dimensional array then how we can create that so I will create an array ARR is the name np dot array is the command then I will give this 
round bracket then you have the square bracket and give some values here 1 2 3 4 and here we have to use the command that is your ending so I will give a command and dim equal to 10 so and d min and d min is the command and then I will just run this so it will give an invalid index might be there is comma here so now if you want to see so we will run this we will just print this now copy and go here and here I here I will take ARR and here I will take ARR and just run this so it will give it's a 10 dimension so it's a multi dimension array so in this way we can create your one dimension two dimension three dimensions array in your Jupyter notebook